In the year 2203 of the Western calendar, the development of science and technology entered a period of stagnation due to a long period of relative peace. But an accident suddenly struck, breaking this relative peace. All over the water blue star, strange dimensional cracks suddenly appeared, and countless monsters walked out of the dimensional cracks and attacked the cities where humans lived. The human warriors fought back against monsters from different dimensions. This monster attack is called the Dimension Beast Attack event. 2204 Gregorian calendar After a year of war of resistance, the human warriors paid a terrible price and barely stopped the invasion of the dimensional beasts. However, in the face of the failure of the locking of the conventional weapons of the old generation after the appearance of the dimensional beast, and the amazing defensive power of the dimensional beast, human beings fell into a hard battle. 2205 Gregorian calendar humans have paid a heavy price to successfully annihilate the vast majority of dimensional beasts on the water blue star, but they cannot close the dimensional cracks at all. In the face of the constant flow of dimensional beasts, humans decided to retreat to major cities. 2206 Gregorian calendar Most of the small countries on the water blue star were destroyed by dimensional beasts. In order to survive, human beings have established three major human powers based on the continental plates. They are, Scylla Alliance, Human Renewal Unity, Free Federation 2207 Gregorian calendar The attacks of dimensional beasts are more active, and human beings are facing the crisis of life and death. At this time, countless steel giants descended from the sky, repelling the dimensional beasts and sheltering humans. In the same year, a game called Machine Warfare was born and swept the entire Water Blue Star. 2210 Gregorian Calendar The three major countries of mankind, the first batch of giant robots called Mobile Weapons were born and entered mass production. 2233 Western Calendar 30 years have passed since the Dimensional Beast Attack incident. In that infinitely far away, yet incomparably close place. A soul quietly arrives in this world from the other side of the world, opening a new story. Have virtue, wake up, have virtue, wake up quickly. Well, let me sleep a little longer. Don't sleep, I should go. Dazedly raised his head from the sofa, Lin Yude looked around blankly and saw a messy living room and the big face of his good friend. Ah Sing, why are you at my house? An Zingzing's face was full of black lines, you are in a daze, didn't you pull me out to drink last night and ended up being a complete mess? You have virtue, I'm not telling you, although the art academy you wanted to apply for was rejected. But in our age, studying art really has no future. If you have the heart to engage in art, it is better to go to the military academy. Maybe you can make military achievements. Getting promoted and getting rich failed. Lin Yude was a little confused. He is a social animal who has graduated for a long time. What did he lose? He is an otaku who has no artistic talent and only knows how to play games. What does he have to do with the art academy? In confusion, Lin Yude felt a pain in his head, and a huge amount of information poured into his brain, causing Lin Yude to hug his head and curl up on the sofa in pain. Hey. Yude, are you all right? In Ni Zingzing's nervous shouting, Lin Yude's face gradually calmed down, and the information in his mind was calm, no more pain. I'm fine, I just suddenly felt a headache. Hearing this, Ni Sing Sing breathed a sigh of relief, that's normal, you drank too much last night, and it's like this after a hangover. Now that the matter has passed, the first choice has failed so let's take a look at the second choice. Let's go with the third choice. It's really not good. It's also a good way to follow me to the military academy. Well, I'll consider it. Lin Yude smirked, completely ignoring Ni Zingzing's words. His heart has set off a huge wave at this moment. The information pouring into his mind just now made him understand what the situation is now. Water Blue Star the United Nations of Human Renewal? What the hell, I also caught up with the Crossing Army. Or a futuristic sci-fi world. 
sorting out the information pouring into his mind, Lin Yudei had countless grooves in his heart that he wanted to vomit, but he was completely unable to vomit. He is squatting at home. He has just cleared Super Robot Wars 30 with his front feet at home, and is waiting for the game to update the follow-up DLC. How did you travel back to this near-future sci-fi world? I really don't know where to start ranting. Fortunately, according to the memory in my mind just now, Lin Yudei seems to be called Lin Yudei in this world, and his appearance and personality are not much different from his original self. Except that the age has changed from the uncle who has graduated back to the 18-year-old young man who has just completed the college entrance examination, the other things are not bad. By the way, is this an alternative version of Back to 18? Virtuous. Ah. Awake, did you call me? Lin Yudei raised his head blankly, while Ni Sing Sing helped his forehead helplessly. It seems that you haven't recovered from your hangover. You should rest more if you are so confused. It's getting late, and I should go back. Oh, I'll send it to you. No, no, you should continue to lie down. I still have something to do, so I'll go back first. Don't take it to heart if you lose the election. If you have anything, please contact me. Well, I see. Lin Yudei sent an I Sing Sing away in a dizzy manner, sitting on the sofa in the living room, Lin Yudei still didn't recover too much. Because he was completely overwhelmed by the memories of the general situation of the world in his mind, and some of them couldn't find Bei. Through the memory in his mind, Lin Yudei confirmed that he had crossed over, and this place is no longer the Earth. It's a planet called Water Blue Star. Water Blue Star has three major human kingdoms, the Free Federation, the Human Innovation Unity, and the Scylla Alliance. The history of this world gradually emerged in my mind. For details, please refer to the preface, Lin Zheiming's face became paler the more he looked. I'll go, right? Is this world so chaotic? The dimensional beast invades, and human beings are at stake. What's all this and what, am I in the world of the Z series of war machines? Isn't this too dangerous? Sure enough, Shui Langzing is too dangerous. I'd better go back to Mars. No, Mars is not necessarily safe in this world. After all, Earth is safer, but unfortunately I can't go back. Silently lying back on the sofa, Lin Yudei now probably understands why he in this world would apply for the art school instead of joining the military. Without it, I'm only afraid of death. Is it bad to live? Taking what his friend Ni Sing Sing had said before as a deaf ear, Lin Yudei made up his mind not to go to the military academy. Anyone who has played machine combat and watched the Gundam series knows that the battlefield is a meat grinder, and even if there is a mecha, it will not reduce the mortality rate much. Moreover, even if you are a soldier, you may not be able to use armor. The death rate of the top soldiers without mecha is really too high. You are not the protagonist, what if the ball dies? I haven't lived enough yet. Wait a minute, did I just see the word machine warfare in my memory? As an old mecha fan, Lin Yudei suddenly bounced off the bed. After searching for the memory of machine battle in his memory, Lin Zheiming's expression gradually became subtle. The epic-making game product Machine Warfare, which is suspected to be a shape technology, can be 100% restored to the special game of the machine as long as the blueprint can be brought out from it. The Star of Hope for Mankind to Reverse the Tide of War? 100% Immersive Experience a mysterious work that can only be logged in at the age of 18. UU reading www.uuganshu.com The interweaving of virtuality and reality, a fantasy game that strengthens the body inside and outside the game synchronously. A new blueprint is the ladder to get rich overnight, and countless gamers serve the country. Linz Hyming muttered, his expression became more and more strange. How can there be such a strange thing in this world? Is this machine battle the machine battle in my memory? Quickly according to memory, he found his portable computer, and went to the internet to find information. 
Linsheiming quickly saw a lot of familiar or unfamiliar organisms. Iron Man Formulation Zaku Leon I'll go, why am I so familiar with the bodies of these three major countries? Isn't this undead? Why is it called Jishibing? Isn't this a fierce bird? How is it called Xiaojiba? And what the is Hushu? Is this tower Miaogura jest? Looking at the body displayed on the screen, Lin's Heiming's eyes almost popped out. At this moment, he suddenly felt that the world didn't seem so bad anymore. At least, there are real radishes in this world, or super radishes, super robots. It's more like traveling to a medieval world to play swords and magic belts. Well, wait a minute, how come I watched for a long time and didn't see Gundam? Where is my Gundam? After searching for a long time, Lin's Heiming was sure that there seemed to be no Gundam in this world. Turning his gaze slowly to the machine warfare game warehouse that had been placed in his room for a long time, Lin's Heiming felt that it was necessary for him to enter the machine warfare game in this different world to find out. But before that, I have to do some homework first. I wasn't 18 years old before, so I couldn't log into this game. Now that I'm full, I have to go and see the guide above. That's it, I have a general understanding. Leaning on the chair, Lin Yude sorted out the information he had just collected. First of all, there is no Gundam in this world. Whether it is Gundam, 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 or Gundam and Gundam Alloy, all of them cannot be found in the search engine. The concept of Gundam does not exist in this world. The concepts of MS and mobile weapons exist, but they generally refer to Zaku and Jean. Secondly, the vast majority of robots in this world are indeed the same as the data in memory, from the game Machine Warfare. As long as you can obtain a brand new machine that no one has ever obtained in Machine Warfare, even if it is only an enhanced version, you can still obtain blueprints, so as to sell them to the country and become rich overnight. Among them, there are many ways to obtain a brand new body, but the most convenient one is the elf questions and answers that every newcomer will experience when they log into the account for the first time. There are only five questions in total. As long as the answers in the spirit questions and answers are different, there is a chance to obtain a brand new body. According to the information found, the first question of the elf Q&A is a fixed style, and the subsequent questions will change depending on the answer. The more different this change is from others, the greater the probability of obtaining a new body, and vice versa. You can refuse the spirit Q&A, skip this link, and directly obtain the first generation mobile weapons provided by the three major countries and the system by default from the data. This option is basically not used by anyone, so I won't go into details. At the same time, after testing by countless people, the guide sprites in the spirit questions and answers are the lowest level AI that is completely mechanized and cannot be touched. No feedback other than a Q&A will be given, so don't expect any hints from the wizard. The above is summed up from the introduction to human renovation and integration of official aircraft warfare guide and the strategies spontaneously organized by netizens. Finally, Lin Yude confirmed. After traveling by himself, he didn't have any golden fingers. What superpower, grandpa, system? Absolutely non-existent, not a single one. What Lin Yude can rely on is only the memory from another world, that's all. After sorting out the information and integrating the current situation, in order to change the future, Lin Yude decided to take a risk. Open the game compartment according to memory, and click on the machine warfare option. Lin Yude felt a stream of light flickering around him, and a special effect similar to time travel enveloped this visual area. There was no change in the body, but when he reacted, he was in the universe in a state of no gravity. In that dark vast universe, looking at the little starry sky, Lin Yude was shocked by the cosmic space that looked like a real scene. The vastness of the universe and the insignificance of itself impacted Lin Yude's mind. Suddenly, a white light cut through the pitch-black universe and arrived in front of him in a blink of an eye. In a ball of light, 
a girl like a fairy in a fairy tale flapped her wings and danced in front of Lin Yude. With a mechanically rigid tone, he guided the elf to speak expressionlessly. Welcome new warriors to the world of machine warfare. In order to play better, please cooperate with me to answer a few questions. Will you cooperate, warrior? Knowing that this is the so-called guide fairy, Lin Yude was calm. He shook his hand in front of the guide fairy, tried to touch the air wall and other operations, but did not get any response from the guide fairy. After verifying that the strategy on the internet was true, Lin Yude took a deep breath and replied to the rigid guide wizard. Okay, please ask questions. The guide elf walked around Lin Yude with the golden light spots falling from his wings, then returned to Lin Yude and waved his hand, and a virtual screen popped up. Question 1, Why did you choose the game Machine Wars? Lin Yude, who was already prepared, took a deep breath and replied. To drive Gundam. Lin Yude felt that his heart rate had accelerated a lot. That's what he's going to risk. There is no Gundam in this world, only he and this machine warfare no Gundam. Gundam, as the three masters of the aircraft combat series, is not absent all year round. In addition to the original AUG series, Gundam is never absent in the Machine War series, and it is an evergreen tree like the Demon series. And now, he said Gundam, a keyword that does not currently exist on the Water Blue Star, will Machine Warfare respond? Machine Warfare is obviously not the product of the Water Blue Star civilization, but more like the product of the Earth civilization. If the person behind Machine Warfare finds out that he knows the keywords of Gundam, will he react? As long as there is Gundam in this machine war, then there is a great possibility that he will be discovered. This is the risk that Lin Yude is going to take. It is undoubtedly very dangerous to expose yourself just after crossing. But Lin Yude had no choice. In this world where robots are mass-produced and armed and dimensional beasts are raging. It is difficult for ordinary people to survive. It is the safest to get blueprints and get on the national line through machine warfare. And as the so-called high risk and high return go hand in hand, as long as the behind the scenes mastermind of machine warfare doesn't do it himself, then he will earn it. In Lin Yude's expectation, the guide elf's eyes flickered, and he responded quickly. Question 2, Why do you want to drive a Gundam? Lin Yude's heart jumped, and he almost jumped up with excitement. In this game, there is indeed a Gundam. Machine Warfare really has something to do with the Machine Warfare series that I played before I crossed. Resisting the excitement, Lin Yude calmed down and replied. Because I'm a boy. As the saying goes, men should drive Zaku, and boys should drive Gundam. As a boy, isn't it only natural for me to drive Gundam? Guiding the light in the elf's pupils to flicker again. Lin Yude swallowed nervously. Now that my previous guesses have been verified, what I have to do now is to attract the attention of the behind the scenes of machine warfare, and uuwww.uuganshu.com to get the drawings of Gundam. This time, Lin Yude didn't wait long, the guide elf blinked, smiled, and asked a new question again. Question 3, Who is your favorite Gundam driver? Lin Yude dragged his chin and thought for a moment before giving an answer. Amuro Rei, Domen Kasho, Kira Yamato, Setsuna F. Kiyoi, Yuragi Hiroshi. Just like reporting the names of dishes, Lin Yude reported the names of all the protagonists of Gundam in all dynasties. The guide elf smiled and tilted his head slightly, and blurted out the fourth question. Question 4, Which Gundam is your favorite? Lin Yude, New Gundam, Z Gundam, ZZ Gundam, Unicorn Gundam, God Gundam, Strike Freedom Gundam, Quantum Zero Zero Gundam. After talking about the final machine that the protagonists of the past dynasties opened again, Lin Yude heard the fifth question of the guide spirit without any pause. Then, if you were asked to choose your initial machine, which model would you choose as the initial machine to enter the world of machine warfare? You can only choose three at most, and it can only be the initial model. Guide the elf with a mischievous smile, staring at Lin Yude, waiting for his answer. 
Knowing that this is the final question and answer for choosing a body, Lin Yude thought carefully and replied. Original Gundam, Strike Gundam, and Angel Gundam. Guide the elf's hands together. Then, warrior, welcome to the world of machine warfare, I wish you a happy playing. Before Lin Yude could respond, a light lit up on his body and disappeared without a trace. Guiding the elf to put his hands behind his back, with a string of silver bell-like laughter, he swept away a light and disappeared into the universe. So, I won my gamble. Lin Yude looked at the place full of technology, similar to Naku, and tried to calm down his excitement and anxiety. Just after the elf question and answer ended, Lin Yude only saw that the guide elf folded his hands together, and the surrounding space began to change. At that moment, Lin Yude thought he was going to be killed by black hands. As a result, the environment gradually blurred, and when it became clear again, Lin Yude was safe and sound, standing on the floor here. Looking at the virtual screen unfolding in front of him, Lin Yude was still agitated. Judging from the current results, he really won the bet. It seems that the mastermind behind machine warfare did not attack him. But there seems to be no positive response. Lin Yude doesn't know exactly what the other party meant. But now that the other party didn't attack him, it should be good news. Looking at the initial machine selection interface in front of him, Lin's Hyming felt a surge of emotions. Gundam, I succeeded. In the virtual screen interface, the interfaces of three Gundams are listed separately. Then, the special bonus that comes with unlocking the suit is also listed below. Select Interface Initial Body 1, Gundam Armament, Head Vulcan, Beam Saber, Beam Rifle, Anti-Beam Shield Special Ability, None Applicable Type, Airland ACCUA Initial Special Reward, New Human. Initial Unit 2, Strike Gundam Armament, Head Vulcan Cannon, Fighting Knife Asterisk 2 Special Ability, PS Armor Applicable Type. Airland ACCUA Initial Special Reward, Adjuster. Initial Body 3, Gundam Amphibious Armament, GN Vulcan Cannon, GN Beam Saber 2, GN Beam Dagger 2 Special Ability, GN Power Furnace Applicable Type, Air Airland ACAUA Initial Special Reward, Pure Species Transformer, Unawakened, Looking at the Initial Special Reward in the Information Box, Lin Yude was stunned. Initial Special Rewards is the first reward that is touched by players among all the special rewards in the game in Machine Warfare. This reward is available to everyone and is a novice welfare reward. And most of the abilities given are innate abilities. Since this is a special reward that everyone can access, the online guide is also very complete. This reward will give a specific type of reward based on the three types of units that are initially unlocked. For example, if you unlock a long-range shooting body, you will most likely get the talent reward of Shooting Mastery LV1. On the other hand, if you unlock a mech that is purely close combat, there is a high probability that you will get the talent reward of Fighting Proficiency LV1. Although the number of talent rewards is extremely complicated, the means of obtaining them are so rare that they can be ignored. Therefore, the talent reward given by the initial unlocking of the body is one of the rare shortcuts. At the same time, there is also a legend circulating on the internet. It is said that if you can unlock the initial machine of a type of body, you may get a unique talent reward. It was based on this legend that Lin Yude chose these three units as his initial units. Because Yuanzhu Gundam, Strike Gundam, and Angel Gundam are three completely different Gundam systems. Although it is not a real prototype, due to the problem of animation appearance, in the eyes of most animation parties, it is the same status as a prototype. Lin Yude admitted that he had gambling elements in it. But as far as the result is concerned, he won the bet, and it was the kind that was full of money. The legend is true, the talent reward he received is the iconic talent ability in the three Gundam systems. New humans, adjusters, Pure Transformers, Unawakened, each of them is extremely powerful. New Type, an existence that evolved autonomously after human beings entered the universe. It has the ability to discern space, 
the ability to see through the essence of things to a certain extent, the ability to sense mental power to communicate regardless of spatial distance, and the ability to still exist after death. Adjuster, humans born through genetic adjustment, artificial geniuses artificially adjusted, with abilities far exceeding ordinary humans in all aspects, extremely strong learning ability, and special human beings called seed potential abilities. And there is no exception for the adjusters, all of them are handsome men and beautiful women, and the gospel of the party. Pure transformers, humans who have been transformed into human beings who have been bathed in a large number of GN particles from the twin drive system for a long time. They have mental power sensing capabilities far beyond ordinary people, similar to new human beings, and have a terrifying intuition to see the essence of things at a glance. Combat talent also quite powerful. These are some of Lin Yude's cognitions through animation. It's just that, unlike the new humans and the adjusters, the pure variety of changers given by the angel Gundam Unlock does not seem to be a full version. The lack of awakening shown in parentheses made Lin Yude feel that this innate ability seemed to be the weakest among the three. It is different from a new human whose awakening method is unknown, and it is also different from an adjustment that requires skillful genetic adjustment to continue adjusting. Lin Yude knew about the awakening method of the changer. As long as he bathes in GN particles long enough and the density of GN particles is high enough, he can wake up. Unless the face is very dark, it is unlikely that it will not wake up. Therefore, the unawakened pure species changer chooses the lowest sequence in Lin Yude's mind. Almost without hesitation, Lin Yude chose to unlock Yuanzua Gundam as his first body. The reason why it is not another body is also very simple. Lin Yude has never learned the knowledge of airframe driving, and choosing an unawakened pure type innovator will not help you quickly master airframe driving now. Although the adjuster has strong learning ability, it takes time to learn. Only the new human beings have the ability to open up the Gundam, Yu Yu reading www. If you touch yuyuganshu.com twice, you will basically use it but the strong one will not work. And because of the particularity of the game Machine Warfare, Lin Yude's talents obtained in the game will be synchronized with the real world. What really happened in reality is that no matter whether it is relying on new humans, they are able to directly touch the MS and run away. Or relying on the characteristics of new humans to perceive the goodwill or malice of the other party, they can turn bad luck into good luck. Therefore, the special ability of the new human is what Lin Yude hopes to obtain most. Unawakened pure changers and adjusters will not have much influence on the status quo in reality, but are not in a hurry. Yes, no hurry. The three units that are initially unlocked, except for the first unit that is initially obtained for free, the other two can be acquired in the subsequent process through some methods, so as to obtain all three kinds of talent abilities. Therefore, the unawakened pure species of changers and adjusters will get their hands sooner or later, so there is no question of the choice between talent and body. In addition, due to emotional reasons, Lin Yude also felt that the first Gundam to appear in this world had to be the original Gundam. Who made him the ancestor of all Gundams? Then, it's decided to be you, Yuanzia Gundam. Clicking the unlock button of Yuanzua Gundam, the virtual screen turned into countless light spots, entering Lin Yude's body. A feeling that is so wonderful that it is like a fairy, which makes Lin Yude have the illusion that everything is in control. At the same time, in front of Lin Yude, a white, blue, and red robot with a V-shaped antenna head slowly appeared. Looking at the steel giant, Lin Yude was excited. Master is finally going to drive a Gundam, a Muro, did you see that? I, Lin Yude, are going to drive a Gundam. This is the cockpit of Yuanzua Gundam? Why is it different from the animation, and it doesn't look so old? Sitting in the cockpit of Gundam, Lin Yude was familiar with the various operations of Gundam while looking at the information panel in front of him. Personal panel name, Lin Yude nickname, Amuro Ray Talent, Strong Luck, New Humanity Rank, Nun Naku, Eight Own Body, Gundam Armament, Nun Parts Library, Nun Unlocked Body, Strike Gundam, Angel Gundam Tokens, 
3M coins, 0 special item, identity creation card asterisk 2 Looking at the information on the personal panel, Lin Yude fell into deep thought. So, why do I have the talent of strong luck? It's not like it hasn't happened that you don't need to be strengthened by a machine warfare, and you have talent skills when you enter the game. But most of those precedents are that some people have some special abilities in reality, so they will be displayed in the game. For example, if you are a graduate of a military academy in reality and shoot targets every day, after entering the game, you will most likely show that you have the innate ability of shooting proficient. These are easy to understand. After all, the reality and the game are completely synchronized, and there will be abilities. The game can affect the reality, and the reality can also affect the game. But the problem is that the skill of strong luck seems to be innate, not acquired the day after tomorrow. In the Machine War series games, the effect of strong luck is to obtain 1.2 times the funds. But often those who have this skill are basically the protagonists, and they are all protagonists with a rich history of crashes. It seems that this skill is only assigned to let the protagonist survive the crash and explosion. Looking at the strong luck skills in his profile, Lin Yude was a little flustered. Could it be that I will also have a rich experience of surviving a plane crash? As for whether he is the protagonist or not, Lin Yude has no entanglement. Anyway, I've been through time. What's wrong with being a protagonist? Besides, are there still few protagonists in the War Machine series? That's not too much, it's okay to run around all over the place. Nothing fancy. Silently closing the information panel, Lin Yude took a deep breath and muttered. Don't be afraid, as long as I don't go to the battlefield, I won't be able to experience a crash like an explosion. No problem, just stay. I can do it. Reopening the information panel, Lin Yude glanced at it and opened the mall. As a game, a game store also exists. Most of the trading methods in the game are carried out through tokens and M coins. Among them, tokens can only be obtained through system distribution and task rewards. The main function of the token is to repair the body wear, body modification and a series of other services. Is the main currency in the game. M coins communicate with reality and can be recharged with real money, which can be used to purchase items in the mall or used in transactions with players. Obviously, machine warfare is obviously not a product of this world, and it can still be recharged with the currency of this world. Lin Yude wanted to complain about this slot, but there was no one around, so he held back. Taking a quick glance, Lin Yude glanced at his nickname again, and nodded his head. The game Machine Warfare is different from other games. If you want to create a game identity, you need to use an identity creation card. Only by using this to create a game identity can the game be played. This game identity is similar to a vest, not an innovative account in the true sense. Just create an ID that the player uses in the game. Koneku and everything like the body are common and are not affected. Creating an identity is just a way to connect with people and change the look and voice of the game to a certain extent. Why is it so special, Lin Yude thought about it. Guess it should be related to the particularity of machine warfare. The enhancements in the game can be synchronized in reality, and the bodies obtained in the game can also be created in reality. Therefore, this kind of thing must be stopped. However, as a PvP confrontation game, machine warfare is definitely not less of grudges and hatreds. As a gamer, it's normal to have strange names one by one. Therefore, it is not difficult to understand that an identity creation card similar to the name change card will appear. As for other in-depth details, Lin Yude was too lazy to think too much. Now is not the time to think about that. There is no need to explain the name Amuro Ray. You can change your identity at any time, so isn't it normal to call yourself Amuro Lei, the original founder of Gundam? The original Gundam was created by M. Rory. After casually browsing the game store, Lin Yude sighed and silently closed the game store. It's really hard to beat a hero with a penny, it's all things that can't be bought. Putting on the helmet, 
Lin Yude pressed the novice training button in machine warfare. Through the monitor in the cockpit, Lin Yude found that the environment he was in was no longer Naku, but a barren plain. At the same time, the guide elf who had met before appeared in front of Lin Yude again. Hello, recruit, welcome to use novice training, please follow my instructions and start your training. First of all, please move the body forward. According to the guidance of the wizard, Lin Yude began to control Gundam to walk forward. I don't know if it is because of the characteristics of new human beings, but Lin Yude easily completed the guidance and walked smoothly. The smooth feeling of manipulating the body like hands and feet made Lin Yude call the new humans awesome. Then, please use the body's own armament to defeat the target. Your body is a Gundam, and you have a head Vulcan. Please use the head Vulcan to shoot. Aiming at the Bulsi, Gundam's head Vulcan began to roar, tearing apart the target that appeared out of thin air. Next is moving target training. Your body is a Gundam, and you have a beam rifle. Please use the beam rifle to shoot at the moving enemies at medium distances. Raise the beam rifle, Gundam fires, and the three moving targets are instantly destroyed. UU reading www.uugonshu.com Very good, you did a good job, recruit. Next, let's do combat training. Your body is a Gundam, and you have a beam saber. Please use the beam saber to attack the enemy. There was an old Zaku in front of him, and Gundam pulled out his beam saber and chopped it up. A sword struck, and Zaku turned into a mosaic and disappeared. Withdraw the beam saber and pick up the beam rifle. Very good, recruit, you have completed all the training. It took 55 seconds in total. Your talent is very strong. Next, you can officially start your machine war journey. In order to let you integrate into the game faster, the system automatically matches you with a PvP. I wish you a happy game. The surrounding environment flashed and Lin Yude suddenly found that he had changed from a wasteland terrain to a plain terrain. Directly opposite him, a green-skinned cyclops, Zigu, was waiting eagerly. Before she could figure out what was going on, a man's arrogant voice sounded on the public channel. The record is zero. I'm so lucky to meet a rookie who just entered the game. Come on, rookie, let me teach you a lesson, machine combat is not so easy to play. Be obedient and turn it into my hit count. Zaku raised his 105mm machine gun and fired at Gundam. The bullet landed on Gundam's armor and picked up the spark, but it had no effect. This scene made the arrogant man's voice change in tone on the public channel. What the hell, is this ghost body armor so thick? My 105mm machine gun can't shoot through the frontal hits? Is this really a first-generation machine that novices can drive? Sitting in the cockpit of Zaku, Wang Hao was shocked. As an active-duty soldier, Wang Hao knows very well that the first-generation aircraft given by the system is the lowest quality one. Paper-thin skin is the most appropriate to describe these. Among the first-generation machines that are easiest for beginners to get, the defense is generally not high. Relying on Zaku's 105mm machine gun, how can it penetrate some armor? It's not the Extreme Soldier series, which is a first-generation machine developed by Human Innovation and Integration, which mainly uses armor. The general machine can't withstand the armor of Zaku's 105mm machine gun. Zaku's armament, although not the most aggressive among all first-generation aircraft, is enough to break defenses against all first-generation aircraft. Moreover, as a general-purpose body, Zaku's comprehensive quality in all aspects is superior to that of Iron Man and Formula. Note 1, without considering the air combat, the only ones with the strongest comprehensive performance are Zaku and Jean. But Jean's armament tends to be heavy firepower and suitable for fighting in space. In the land battlefield, Zaku is undoubtedly a more suitable choice. This is also one of the reasons why Wang Hao, as an active soldier, chose Zaku instead of other generation aircraft. But now his cognition has been broken. An unseen first generation machine made Zaku's 105mm machine gun unable to break defenses. 
While Wang Hao was shocked, he quickly made a judgment. Although the defensive power is amazing, the combination of rifle and shield, this machine should be a machine for medium and long distance combat. In that case, Zaku threw away the 105mm machine gun that could not break through the Gundam armor, and pulled out his thermal axe. Close combat is more beneficial to us. The Zaku thruster began to roar and charged towards Gundam. Although the body is very strong, he is still a rookie after all, so he must have been shocked by the sudden PvP match. I got your shot count. The thermal axe was aimed at Gundam's head and chopped off. Wang Hao controlled Zaku and deliberately avoided Gundam's shield, trying to slash the axe from the head to the chest cockpit, killing him in one hit. However, what surprised Wang Hao was that Gundam, who had not moved at all, suddenly dodged sideways, dodging his axe that would kill him with one blow. What? The thrusters behind Gundam also began to roar. A huge impact knocked Zagu flying, making Wang Hao in the cockpit dizzy for a while. Wow, this is... When he raised his head, Wang Hao saw Gundam aimed his gun at himself. The trigger was pulled, the pink beam flashed, and the flames of the explosion swept over. The next moment, Wang Hao found himself back in the waiting hall before entering the battlefield. Looking at the prompt you have been shot down in front of him, Wang Hao was a little confused. Light, beam rifle. How is that possible? Why does a novice who hasn't even fought a battle have this kind of equipment? Beam weapons, don't they have to be unlocked in the follow-up missions? What exactly is that first-generation machine that I haven't seen before? In Wang Hao's confusion, several men next to him came over and patted him on the shoulder. Wang Hao, how's it going, the video I said before is ready to be recorded, right? We're going to be the instructors for those training soldiers next month. Have you got the actual combat video for the training soldiers? Looking at his comrades beside him, Wang Hao replied dumbly, No, I was shot down. What? All the comrade Eason arms looked beautiful and were dumbfounded. Comrade Ein arms, no, didn't we ask you to go to the novice channel and tune in the videos recorded by the novice who just entered the game? Why did you get shot down? You shouldn't go to other channels, right? Wang Hao shook his head, no, I just went to the novice channel, and the match was a rookie with zero record. When the comrade Ein arms heard this, he patted his head and said, I see, you met two Yu Lao Yin Bai who went to fry fish just like you, right? It's okay, this kind of thing happens often, just record it again. Another comrade Ein arms patted Wang Hao on the shoulder, yeah, this kind of thing is no big deal. Now many people are like us, and they want to record videos to show the recruits. I guess we crashed with other people who also recorded videos. Wang Hao shook his head, it's different. The comrades in arms wondered, what's the difference? Wang Hao recalled his battle record sheet with a complicated expression. I can be sure, that's a real new guy. When I first attacked him, he didn't react. So I can be sure. The comrades in arms were even more puzzled, then how did you get shot down? Where's the video? Pull it out and let's see. Wang Hao called up the video, so everyone could see the short video. Zaku and Gundam appeared, and the distance was very close. Zaku attacked first, and Gundam was unharmed. Zaku threw away the machine gun and took out the thermal axe for melee combat. After being dodged, he was hit by Gundam's shield in melee combat. Gundam raised the beam rifle to shoot, and the battle was over. The whole process is 15 seconds, and the one that ends the battle is a neat one. After everyone read it, they fell silent. Such a close distance is something that happens in a novice battle, and the guy's initial reaction seems to be really a novice. It looks like it is, but why does he react so quickly? Doesn't it usually take a real rookie more than 10 seconds to react? I don't know. From the looks of it, it doesn't seem to be a student of the military academy. The students of the military academy will not be unresponsive at first. And the final counterattack is not like a student. That's, 
a gamer with extraordinary talent. It looks like this is the case. Everyone looked at the silent Wang Hao, not knowing how to comfort him. Wang Hao usually has a high self-esteem, so he took the initiative to take over the task of recording the video, so that he can show his operation in front of everyone. As a result, he died before his apprenticeship, which is probably a big blow to him with high self-esteem. A comrade in arms said to the crowd in order to comfort him. By the way, what is that body? Why have you never seen it before? I don't know. It doesn't look like the Zaku series or the Leon series, but it's a bit like the Xiaojiba series. Maybe it's a derivative of the Xiaojiba series. It should be, after all, it is impossible for a newcomer to have a special machine in an accident, and it is limited to a first generation machine, so it is estimated that it can only be a trial made machine. But what's that machine called? Let's see, the battle information is the pilot's name is Amuro Ray and the nickname seems to be someone from the Alliance or the Federation. The body is... Gundam. Gundam? Isn't it Xiao Chiba? On the plane, Lin Yudei controlled the Gundam to retract the beam rifle, and looked at the wreckage of Zaku in front of him speechlessly. This system is really sick. Just after training, you go directly to PvP? What's the difference between going to challenge the boss just after you're familiar with the game operation? Thanks to my new human's reliable characteristics, or else I'll be planted here and waste one token to repair the body. But... Looking at it now, PvP battles don't seem to be too difficult. Aim at the cockpit, and you're done with one shot from Bayou. D, the system prompts a sound. Lin Yude opened the menu and looked at the mail button. Note 1 PS, the body data of this book is mainly set by the author. Mail system prompt, congratulations to the player for completing the novice teaching, the task interface has been unlocked, I wish you a happy game. Attachment, token asterisk 10 a very brief little email with 10 tokens as a gift. Lin Yude is not surprised by the small rewards given after the completion of the novice teaching. Many games have this kind of routine. Although the machine battle is strange, it is also covered with a game shell. It is normal to have these. Without paying too much attention, Lin Yudei glanced at the countdown to exit the battlefield in front of him. Just press return to personal warehouse and open the task interface that was just unlocked. On the task interface, there is still a little red dot that can make obsessive compulsive disorder sick. Task interface task overview 1. Beginner's Requirement, Complete the Novice Teaching, and Officially Play Machine Warfare Reward, 1000M Coins, Simple Repair Device Asterisk 10 2. First Shot Down Requirements, In PvP Mode, Shoot Down 1 Enemy Plane Reward, Random Enhanced Parts Box Asterisk 1 3. Work Hard, Miscellaneous Soldiers Requirements, In PvP Mode, Shoot Down 10 Enemy Planes Reward, Random Armed Parts Box Asterisk 1-4 Armed Unlock Gundam Requirements, in PvP mode, use fixed armament and shoot down 10 enemy planes progress, 0-10 reward, Gundam Armament Meteor Hammer sitting in the Gundam cockpit, Lin Yude glanced at the automatically filled energy meter and the state of the body that showed normal, and took the rewards for the two completed tasks. Simple Repair Device, it can repair the non-destructed body in the Naku, or repair the non-damaged state of the external armament, without the need for tokens. Random Enhanced Component Box, Randomly Obtain a Enhanced Component. Lin Yudei was not surprised to receive these two mission rewards. This is something that the Beginner's Guide has said, and Lin Yudei has long known that he will get it. The game Machine Warfare is somewhat similar to the Azalane that Lin Yudei played before Crossing, which is commonly known as the game of the Ship Girl. In this game, the body is generally divided into four states, small break, medium break, big break, and destroyed. Except for the wreck, as the name suggests, the explosion is completely unusable. The remaining four states correspond to the following, Xiapo, the overall components are sound, torso and limbs and head display and main thruster, and the main body armor is broken to the point of losing its defense. 
medium brake, damage to limbs or head display or main thruster. Big brake, incapacitated. In the game of aircraft warfare, in addition to being destroyed, if you want to repair the body, you need to use two tokens. The rest of the status can be instantly repaired with only one token, and you can start the battle again from Naku. And a token is used to repair the state of small and medium breakage, and some of the gains outweigh the losses. Therefore, the simple repair device, which is similar to the quick repair barrel in the Ship Girl game, has become the only choice for many players to repair the body. Since the simple repair device is a shopping mall item, it needs to be purchased with M coins, so the 10 simple repair devices obtained in the early stage cannot be wasted casually, it is all money. In addition, in the game Machine Warfare, the fixed armament of the body, including the subsequent unlocked armament, is repaired free of charge during the maintenance phase, and does not require the use of tokens or repair devices. However, external weapons, which are additional weapons added to the body, will be additionally repaired and priced. And since there are only two states, broken and damaged, that need to be repaired, the repair is also the difference between one token and two tokens. As a game of machine warfare, it is very common for weapons to be damaged in battle. One token is used to repair a single weapon, which is really expensive. Therefore, many people will use the tokens to repair the body, and the simple repair device will be used to repair the weapons that have not exploded. Also because of this expensive repair cost, the external weapons are called kryptonite weapons. Generally, ordinary players will choose the fixed armament that comes with the body. At the same time, because the excessive weight of the body will affect the mobility and other problems, in addition to long-range fire suppression, the Krypton Gold armament is not necessarily stronger than the body with fixed armament in medium and short-range combat. Of course, if you want to use Krypton Gold props to put some anti-beam coating on the body, or the kind that covers the entire body, it can only be said that people are stupid and have a lot of money, and they are inhuman. In the face of such a local tyrant who likes to burn money, many players will be very happy to teach him to be a man with physical weapons. After briefly recalling the strategies he had seen on the internet, Lin Yudei shook his head, feeling that he would not be able to use these things for the time being. According to the raiders, novices will stay on the primary channel until they complete the task of 20 knockdowns. The primary channel only allows the first generation machine to fight, so there is no need to worry about what kind of anti-celestial machine will appear in the battle. As long as you don't encounter kryptonite players who have powerful external weapons on the machine, or various trial-made machines with explosive performance. With the defensive power of the original Gundam's Gundam Nim alloy, it should be able to occupy a certain advantage in this kind of battle strength that only includes Iron Man, Zaku, and Jean. Of course, in order to save money, Lin Yude felt that it would be more reliable to modify the body before the next battle. As a senior aircraft combat player, Lin Yude deeply understands the importance of aircraft modification. Now this machine warfare also happens to have such a function. Any body can undergo 10STAGE transformation in all aspects. Every time you complete the L round 5STAGE transformation and 10STAGE transformation, you can get a special body transformation reward. This is similar to the machine combat series that Lin Yudei has played. The difference is that the body is modified here, and only one token can be used to change one stage at any stage. At the same time, there is no precise numerical display here. The first stage of transformation is a 5% performance improvement, with a maximum increase of 50%. The exact amount can only be determined by one's own body sense, which is quite metaphysical. Opening the transformation interface, Lin Yude saw his body transformation page. Renovation interface body, Gundam renovation reward, not obtained durability, HP zero change energy, and zero change armor, defense zero change motility, reaction zero change aiming, hit zero mobility, movement zero fixed armament power. Zero change glancing at the type of transformation, Lin Yudei nodded secretly. It is basically the same as the aircraft combat series. 
except for one more mobility modification item, everything else is basically the same. Just as he was planning to strengthen Yuanzhu Gundam, Lin Yude suddenly remembered that he still had a box of random strengthening parts that he hadn't opened, so he quickly opened it. Acquired Enhanced Parts Universal Beam Rifle Sniper Kit Asterisk 1 Universal Beam Rifle Sniper Kit, Range plus 3, Energy Consumption plus 80%, Power plus 50% Looking at this enhanced part, Lin Yude remembered that there is no such thing as an enhanced part slot in this machine warfare. All reinforcement parts will be solidified. You can install as many as you can. But on the contrary, strengthening parts will not be generalized, but will have adaptability. For example, the reinforced armor you use for large moss cannot be installed on ordinary MSS and PTS. And vice versa. All parts are solidified, and adaptation has become a big problem. Lin Yude felt that he was lucky this time, driving to a beam rifle with the widest range of use, which is regarded as a burst of character. But considering that he seems to have the skill of strong luck, whether it is a burst of character, I have to say too. But that's not the point. The point is, seeing this enhanced component, Lin Yude glanced at his beam rifle, and suddenly had a bold idea in his heart. Attach the universal beam rifle sniper kit to the Gundam's fixed armor beam rifle. Lin Yude found that above and in front of Gundam's beam rifle, there was something like a holster mounted on it. On the machine data panel, the fixed armament has also changed. The wording of beam rifle has become sniper beam rifle. The arm that controlled Gundam moved twice, and Lin Yude obviously felt that the arm holding the sniper beam rifle was much slower. The weight also changes, it's very real. But this way, it's not very cost effective to use a beam rifle to fight the enemy in midrange combat. In the game Machine Warfare, there are no clear numerical values displayed in many places. There is absolutely no such thing as the attack range that is usually marked in the aircraft combat series. If it weren't for the fact that the game has been in operation for so many years, and players on the internet have already concluded some general rules, Lin Yude would definitely be blind. In Machine Warfare, players with armed range are distinguished as follows, Range 1, Ultra Short Range Fighting Weapons, Fighting Attacks and Fighting Daggers are listed here. Range 2, Beam Saber, Thermal Axe, Beam Spear, Physical Sword and other weapons all count as this range. Range 3, Weapons that do not exceed the maximum range of the Vulcan Cannon are counted. Range 4, The Most Effective Range for Beam Rifles. Range 5, The Ultimate Range of Beam Rifles. Range 6, Weapons Beyond the Range of the Beam Rifle. Range 7, an armament capable of out-of-sight strikes outside the observation range of conventional monitors. Range 8, beyond Lin off-sight, but within the range of conventional radar monitoring. Range 9, armament beyond radar range. Armament with a range of 10, capable of over-the-horizon strikes. In the game, the range of conventional beam rifles is 4-5. Now that I hit the sniper kit, the range should be around 7-8. Considering the most effective range, the range of 7 is the most reasonable. And the weapons with a range of 7 are all weapons that can achieve out-of-sight strikes, so the sniper beam rifle really deserves its name. Lin Yude touched his chin and silently changed the Gundam fixed armed power to 10. Although the consumption of 10 tokens is high, in order to kill all the units in the novice channel with one hit, Lin Yude feels that this investment is worthwhile. The game Machine Warfare is quite realistic, so the beam weapon is powerful enough to destroy the shield and damage the body. By changing the Gundam's armed power to the maximum, the power-boosting effect of the sniper kit will also be maximized. In this way, the success rate of one-shot kills can be maximized. The last three tokens reserved were not moved, just in case he was shot down and fell into the dilemma of having no tokens to repair the body. The novice channel has no daily tasks, but has a novice benefit. After the tokens are exhausted, three temporary tokens can be obtained the next day. This temporary token cannot be used for functions other than repairing the body. It's still early today, 
and even if Lin Yude wants to use this mechanism, he has no chance. Once the tokens are exhausted and the body cannot be repaired, I can only stare at Gundam in Naku today. This is unacceptable to Lin Yude. I just got Gundam, how can I fall asleep if I don't take advantage of the excitement and drive a few more times? After simply checking the various data of the machine, I sorted out some operational problems in the battle just now. Lin Yude couldn't wait to open the PvP interface. The novice channel has only one option for 1v1 random matchmaking. In addition to PvP, Machine Warfare also has PvE, which is commonly known as a copy. But now the PvE of the novice channel only has an option of training levels. It's boring to play wooden stakes that don't move. It's more fun to play with people. Without hesitation, Lin Yude started the match. The match was successful in less than three seconds. The surrounding scene began to change, and Lin Yude found that the terrain of urban ruins was randomly encountered this time. And unlike before, the opponent from this match did not appear directly in front of him. There was no display on the radar, which made Lin Yude understand that this area had a field effect that would affect radar monitoring. In the words of the Gundam UC series, Minofsky particles are scattered here, which affects the effect of the radar. Of course, this is just Lin Yude's guess. In fact, there is no explanation for this kind of terrain in the game. Except for some reconnaissance airframes, the radars that come with the airframes are limited most of the time. This kind of terrain is very common in the world of machine warfare which is one of the reasons why Lin Yude chose to take the extreme attack route. The radar is not powerful, and the old yin rhythm method of killing one shot outside the line of sight is the fastest option to reduce the number of shots and save money. In the ruins of the city, a green-skinned Cyclops Zico looked around. Che, it seems that I'm not very lucky. I met a guy who was just maliciously sanctioned by the system. Looking at the competitor? Record? 1. El Uzi Elida shook his head. Liuzi, the novice channel is like this. It's either a stupefied green cabbage chicken who doesn't understand anything, or a startled bird who has been maliciously sanctioned by the system. Most players have to go through this stage, you just get used to it. El Uzi Elida's mouth twitched wildly, and he replied to his comrades in the watching channel. It's better not to get used to this kind of thing. Yu reading www.yuyuganshu.com I have no interest in abuse of vegetables. Also, how is Wang Hao? Watching channel, Wang Hao is still studying the video of the previous battle. You can quickly complete the task so that we can go offline and have dinner. El Uzi Elida waved his hand, okay, got it, I'll get it done in a while. I'm familiar with this map on the novice channel, just watch me get it done. Watching channel, come on, little six, we are optimistic about you. Shaking his head slightly, El Uzi focused his attention and controlled Zaku to stick to some ruined buildings as bunkers and start to move forward slowly. I remember that according to big data statistics, 90% of the newcomers who are frightened usually choose to hide behind the ruins of the large gymnasium on this map. That is the only ruin of a large building in this map which can best provide these newcomers with a sense of psychological security. In that case, watch me go around here and give him a surprise. Watching channel, Liuzi, rush, rush. He touched the corner of the ruins of the large gymnasium with ease. El Uzi Elihu controlled Zaku, took out his machine gun and aimed at the back of the ruins. Hey! Little cutie, let me catch it, et. But what surprised El Uzi Elida was that there was nothing there. It's not here, what is this? Drop drop drop. Watching channel, Xiao Liuza be careful. A rapid alarm sounded in the cockpit, and before El Uzi Elida could control Zaku to react, he was swept away by an explosion of flames. The next moment, he appeared in the waiting hall. You have been shot down looking at the system prompt in front of him. El Uzi was stunned. What, the situation? How did I get shot down? In a corner of the waiting hall, several people stood beside El Uzi silent. 
especially Wang Hao, who was just watching the video, looked a little weird when he looked at Liu Ziyaliu. Liu, are you shot down? Wang Hao glanced at the system prompt box in front of Liu Ziyaliu and asked a question deliberately. Liu Ziyaliu's face turned dark, and he called up the battle information. Competitors, Amuro Ray, Gundam vs New Century Liu Xiaofeng, Zika Victor, Amuro Ray, Gundam Seeing this information, Liu Ziyaliu's eyes widened. Is this Amuro Ray again? Wang Hao was also surprised, you actually met him. Comrade Ein Arms Tian Tian, quick, look at the replay, how did you get shot down just now? We didn't see the specific situation at all from the viewing angle. Liu Ziyaliu quickly opened the playback video. A group of people gathered together and watched the video, Liu Ziyaliu's Ziku. Ziku was very safe on his way to the ruined gymnasium, and everyone skipped it. Fast forward until Ziku came to the ruined gymnasium, after a pause because there was no one there. The crowd finally saw it. On the right side of Ziku, a pink light beam galloped forward, pierced through Ziku's right shoulder defense armor, and pierced the cockpit directly. With the explosion of Ziku, the picture gradually stretched and came to a ruin. In a pile of ruined tiles, a gun barrel was finally exposed to everyone's sight. The screen rotated for a while, and a red, blue and white painted Gundam with a V-shaped antenna head appeared in everyone's field of vision. Looking at Gundam lying on the ground, holding a gun and hiding among the ruined tiles, the group was dumbfounded. Wang Hao looked at Gundam, who was finally still in the picture, and said in a daze, it's really him. Tian Tian wondered, isn't this guy a novice? Why does he play ambush? Comrade Ein Arms Zhu Fuqiang touched his chin, maybe, this guy has a big heart and is born with a Lao Yinbai. Comrade Ein Arms Gu Haben nodded and said, judging from the current situation, this is indeed the case. Only in this way can we explain why he has the guts to play counter ambush in the second battle. Comrade Ein Arms Wang Lingxiang approached Liu Ziyaliu and clicked the playback progress bar with his hand to let the screen play back again. When the screen replayed until Ziku was defeated, he pressed pause, and Wang Lingxiang pointed to the screen and said to everyone. Have you noticed, this guy's beam rifle is quite powerful. Ziku's shoulder armor is thicker than other places. But after it was still penetrated, he punched the cockpit and the entire joint of his right leg against each other, and then the destroyed Xiao Lai uses Ziku. A gleam of light flashed in Wang Hao's eyes, his beam rifle has been strengthened. Wang Lingxiang nodded, yes, and I don't know how to strengthen it. I suspect that this newcomer has fully transformed the power of his armed forces. Tian Tian took a sigh of relief, hey. That's not it, right? Which rookie would play so extreme, and only strengthen his weapons, would he feel safe? His body is not a sniper type, and he takes an extreme attack route, and it is easy to die violently. Bar. Wang Hao shook his head, no, he is different. Don't forget, his body armor is quite strong. Zaku's 105mm machine gun can't be penetrated. That is to say, his body defense is on the high side, not at all. We need to carry out defense transformation, and we can also feel safe. Gu Haben's eyes were a little weird, I think the reason why this newcomer behaves so abnormally may have something to do with Wang Hao. Liu Ziyaliu turned to look at Gu Haben, what do you mean? Gu Haben analyzed, don't forget. The reason why the newcomers will become frightened in the second match is basically because they were maliciously dominated by the system in the first match and were attacked by the veterans, and they were scared to death. Of. But this Amuro is different. He blew Wang Hao up in the first game. And the whole process took less than one minute. This kind of crushing victory will make him feel psychological pressure and fear. Wang Lingxiang agreed, it makes sense. The reason why this Amuro dared to play counter ambush in the second game may be that Wang Hao's performance was too poor in the first game, which made his heart swell, and he dared to play like this when he had confidence. That is to say, everyone turned their attention to Wang Hao. 
El Uziah jumped directly to Wang Hao's side and grabbed Wang Hao's neck, it's all your fault. Bastard, let go. Wang Hao kept struggling. Tian Tian said, Lai Uzi, let it go, there is no driver damage determination in the waiting hall, you can't kill anyone like this. Wang Hao's eyes widened. If eyes could kill, Tian Tian would have been killed more than a dozen times. Ignoring the commotion of the two fools, Zhu Fuqiang asked Wang Lingxiang, Brother Wang, are we still looking for video materials to record videos today? Wang Lingxiang's eyes flashed, and he nodded in response, Go ahead, I was beaten down twice in a row. If people from other classes knew about this, where would we put our face? Gu Haben came over and said, So. Wang Lingxiang pressed the shoulders of the two fools and said, Everyone is in the match, and go to snipe this Amuro Lei. According to the naming style of the nickname, this guy is most likely from the Silla Alliance or the Free Federation. Even if not, he is a foreigner. This kind of guy must be punished. Don't fight this guy's arrogance, let him continue to go on like this, the level will not grow very fast. If this guy grows up, going to the army of the Silla Alliance or the Free Federation will not be a good thing for us to reform and unify. Tian Tian's eyes widened, no, brother Wang, isn't it because the newcomer has taught him twice, as for rising to the height of the country. Zhu Fuqiang patted Tian Tian on the shoulder and pointed his finger, I don't understand this, it's called the pattern, do you understand the pattern? Wang Lingxiang clapped his hands and decided, it's such a happy decision, everyone started to match, see if we can snipe this Amuro Lei, knock him over, and use him as video material. Oh. Asterisk N. Not knowing that he was being targeted, Lin Yude manipulated Gundam to get up from the ruins. Looking at Zaku who exploded to the point where only a few fragments remained, Lin Yude had a strange expression. There is really such a stupid guy who will take the bait. It seems that people in this world don't have a high level of IQ. After the battle started, Lin Yude began to look for a suitable place to be a sniper. But he searched for a long time, but he couldn't find the kind of building that had absolute height advantage and could give full play to the advantage of sniper rifles vision. He didn't find any super tall buildings like an SD Gundam before crossing. In desperation, Yu reading www.yuyuganshu.com Lin Yude had no choice but to give up the tactic of squatting on a high-rise building and firing black guns, and switch to ambush tactics. This ruined gymnasium is the location chosen by Lin Yude. Without it, the ruined buildings here are big enough to be used as bunkers, just right for shooting black guns. But soon, Lin Yude thought about it and felt that this plan was not feasible. Because this ruined gymnasium is too big and the ruins are dense, there is no place for him to hide at all. On the contrary, it is a small crater behind the ruins, suitable for squatting. With the mentality of giving it a try, Lin Yude jumped into the small bomb crater, covered the sniper beam rifle with debris tiles, and then piled up the tiles on both sides of the Gundam as a cover. At the beginning of the period, Lin Yude felt that there should be no such stupid people who would come here to look for someone so stupidly, and then be caught by himself. And if you are circumvented by doing this, you have the risk of being ambushed. If the other party gets too close, the radar detects him and he will be exposed. But Lin Yude thought about it, anyway, the Gundam Gundam Nim Alloy has a very high defense, and it should be able to withstand one or two hits. Even if it really doesn't work, just spend money on trial and error. After spending the great token, I washed myself and fell asleep, and I will wake up tomorrow and be a hero again. With this thought in mind, Lin Yude decided to give it a try. Then, in the middle of the ruins, Voldemort's Lin Yude managed to catch a fish. The angle was not adjusted too much. When the trigger was pulled, El Uziah Zika was shot down by Lin Yude's Gundam. Looking at the content of the battle information, Lin Yude shook his head. What about El Yu Xiaofeng in the new century, do people in this world have such thick skin? It seems that I was too conservative before. I should be named new century Wu Yanzu. Pressing the return button, 
Lin Yudei jumped off the Gundam and looked at the Gundam's fuselage from the outside. It is found that after the end of the battle, the body will have an automatic cleaning effect. Lin Yudei re-entered the cockpit with satisfaction, and pressed the match button to start a new round of matching. The terrain of the military factory matched this time. Lin Yudei looked down and was happy. It seems that there is no interference in this terrain, and the radar enemy detection effect can work normally. But this distance. Glancing at the bright spots on the edge of the radar, Lin Yudei controlled Gundam and jumped onto the roof of the factory. After setting up the sniper beam rifle, Lin Yudei opened the scope and saw the galloping in the distance. One thing to say, this sniper kit is really easy to use. It's a bit like the 8x scope used when eating chicken, it's really clear. But this time the opponent is actually an air combat type body. It's good to be able to fly. It would be great if you and Zia Gundam also had a flying backpack. Shaking his head, Lin Yudei concentrated. No, 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 right now, before the other party is close, I will shoot the other party down. Look at me, aim, right now. Amuro Ray, Gundam, Spy. A pink beam pierced the sky above the factory and pierced the edge of the factory. With a gorgeous explosion, Lin Yudei flicked his hand. Oh, see, Uncle Luo, I also have the talent for sniping. Without looking at the match information, Lin Yudei couldn't wait to start the next match after winning three games in a row. Naku, a tall and blonde woman is looking at the screen in front of her stupidly, her whole person looks a little dazed. I'm, shot down. I was shot down without even seeing the opponent's body. At this moment, a handsome blonde young man came over. Fianna, how about it, the fidelity of machine warfare is not comparable to the training cabins produced in China. Fianna looked stupidly at the blonde young man. Brother Felio. Felio seemed to have noticed something wrong with his sister and asked cautiously. What's the matter, Fianna? Did something happen? Fianna silently looked at the panel in front of her. Felio glanced at it and said with a smile, I was shot down. It's not a big deal. It's better to be shot down in the game than to be shot down in reality. The game machine warfare is different from the training cabin you used before. It is full of military elites and folk geniuses from various countries. You just built the ship, and it's not surprising that you were shot down. Fianna clenched her fists in dissatisfaction, but, I was shot down without even seeing the opponent's body. Oh? You show me the playback. At Felio's suggestion, Fianna pressed the playback button, and Felio saw the scene of a sudden explosion in the air. Filio suddenly looked surprised, this is, a beam rifle with a sniper kit. It's no wonder. With this kind of plugin, the opponent's range and enemy search range are far beyond yours, and it's normal for you to be shot down. Now is the time when the militaries of various countries are recording various examples of warning videos for military recruits. You may have run into an old who is not general. But to be honest, Recording a video with this kind of thing, which country's soldier is this, it's too ridiculous. If this is in my army, I have to give him a hard lesson. Also, what is this machine? Why haven't I seen it before? It feels a bit like the Zioba series from the Free Federation. Fianna silently clicked on the battle information. Competitors, Amuro Ray, Gundam vs Golden Nana Victor, Amuro Ray. Gundam Filio was a little surprised, Gundam? What kind of machine is this, I've never heard of it. Fianna's eyes gradually sharpened, a new generation of trial-made aircraft. Looking at the word 3 on the record, Fianna felt more and more dazzling, and Xiophon squeezed her fists even tighter. Seeing his younger sister, who seemed to be competing with something, Felio felt a little helpless. My sister has been strong since childhood. In the military academy, he strived to be at the top, conquered all the trainees in the same class, and was very proud. Now suddenly in the game to be defeated in such a despicable way, I will definitely feel very uncomfortable. However, Felio didn't feel anything about this situation. 
the battlefield is like this, and the advantage of equipment is also an advantage. The battlefield is not playing a house, who will tell you fairness. Now is not a peaceful age, even if humans will tell you fairness, dimensional beasts will not tell you fairness. It's okay to let Fianna suffer a little bit, Machine Wars is not a school, no one will let her. Experience the reality sooner, the better for her. Just as his thoughts fell, Felio was shocked to hear an exclamation not far away. Brother Wong, I was shot down. What a fuss, isn't it just being shot down? No, I was shot down by that Scylla dog from a Muro. What? Filio turned his head to look over, and Fianna heard the movement and quietly turned her head to look at the corner of the waiting hall. There, a group of men were gathered together, discussing. Tian Tian, where's your video? Why did you get shot down? Here, here. I was looking for someone in the canyon terrain. Who would have thought that I had just crossed a small canyon? A beam of light below the canyon blew me up. Hey, although it's in the game, you you reading www.yuyugonshu.com I feel a little pain in the phantom limb in this picture. Is this the point? Feel sorry. Looking at a few people talking, Filio glanced at Fianna and patted her on the shoulder. It seems that the other party is indeed an old fritter. The canyon terrain, hiding in the canyon and waiting for someone to take the bait requires enough patience. Generally impatient newcomers can't do this kind of thing. Fianna whispered back, but, it's less than five minutes since I was shot down. Filio. Cough, this may be a blind cat meeting a dead mouse. Seeing his sister's suspicious eyes, Filio quickly changed the subject. It's getting late, I have to get off first. Fianna, don't think too much, let's have a new battle. Filio was offline, and Fianna looked at Amuro Ray's name on the screen and pursed her lips. Amuro Ray, from Scylla. In the Gundam cockpit, Lin Yude touched his head. This is four consecutive victories? It's not even half an hour, isn't it too fast? Except for the first Zaku that I encountered, the next few were a shot in a second. It doesn't feel like the melee combat I expected. With a strange expression, Lin Yude patted his face, and Lin Yude laughed at himself. I almost forgot, this is the novice area, and it's all newcomers. I'm a newcomer, and bullying rookie players doesn't seem to have anything to be proud of. Forget it, let's hurry up and hit 20 shot downs, and hurry up to the primary channel. It's really boring to bully newbies. Having said that, Lin Yude pressed a new round of matching.